everyone. Good evening. Good evening. I'm going to teach you guys how to secure your Instagram account. And if you have Facebook, this will work for it as well. There's a lot of um, hacking going on uh, these days. I notice a lot of people are getting hacked. I notice a lot of people are getting scammed. And it is just not fair for people to be working so hard for their money. And people come and take your money so easily. So the scammers are out in full force. And in order to stay up to date, you have to be harmed with the information, right? And it's the information that's going to help us uh, to secure our Instagram and Facebook accounts. And you could use this on all forms. So if you're watching me right now, I want you to grab your phone real quick. This will be a, a very short live teaching you how to secure your account, right? Very, very short. All right, so grab your phone, go to settings, right? Go to settings. And here, you can see it on the phone, right? Grab it, go to settings, which um, you can see there, settings. And then you go to security. Go to security and um, number one thing that you may want to do is to change your password first thing. Make sure you have a very strong password um, to secure your account so that it's not easily hacked. Do not click any links. If they send you links in your inbox, don't even open the email. Just delete it and you know forget it right away. Go to the two-factor authentication. The two-factor authentication will assist you in changing your um, in securing your account I'm here I'm in the two factor authentication right I'm teaching you how to secure your account you get started um, you will see uh, that you can secure your account there are three methods that will be underneath it three methods the first method is to use an app and they recommend that but I don't really trust an app, an extra app, you know, to secure my account. You have WhatsApp that you can use. And the reason you can use this is because your, your phone number is just one number that is assigned to you, to each person. And so WhatsApp may be safe to, um, to secure your account. But what I do is to use my phone um, to secure my, I use my phone to secure my accounts um, in the two-factor authentication process. If you, are, if you use YouTube or Facebook, there's also a two-factor or two-step notification process. So I use the text message to log in. So it comes straight to my phone and then I can secure the account to see whether or not it's me. There's a lot of people going around, as I said before, and they're scamming everyone. And if you are not alert, um, you may be a victim of scamming, right? Be careful out there. Everything that we do nowadays is online and it's just not easy for um, anyone to uh, be a victim of scamming where, you know, they steal your money or steal your information. I am a victim. I've had to run about um, for the past couple of days, right? Um, well, today, more so than any other day, to change my bank account information, everything, and um, update, uh, give them an updated information that is needed to secure my assets and whatever it is that I have. So you do this, use the two-factor notification process, go ahead and secure your account, make sure that you change your passwords. I cannot stress this enough. Every six months or so, you can do that. Don't click on any links. Do not click on any links that is sent to your, your inbox because that is one way of them getting um, your information. Um, another way is that they may, contact, they may contact you as a friend, a friend that, that you really know you understand? 
may, they may come to you to uh, sell you information or sell you whatever they're se selling you or they'd want you to invest. And the latest thing nowadays is the Bitcoin scamming where they use the authentic methods such as Cash App or other apps that are verified to um to steal your money and if they uh, send you a link to go outside of 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 the apps do not do that because they are going to steal your money don't upload any money on any apps do not do that right and then transfer it out of the app because that is a problem right there so secure your self secure your accounts it is very important to go into the settings and make sure you have a very strong password they use the people closest to you to basically get you someone who you trust uh they will get at you through that person and um think twice uh one thing you can do is to contact the person directly if you know that individual if you have their phone number contact them directly to ask them if they just wrote you about Bitcoin they wrote you about um, whatever link and codes they'll send to you just make sure you're verified with your friends before you proceed stay safe out there the cyber world is also a dangerous one and uh, since of late there are many people getting scammed and you don't want to be a part of this secure your account don't use the same emails that you use to communicate with to create your accounts use a different email yeah so another thing you'd want to do in the two-factor authentication process is to click on learn more right um, in the learn more under two-factor authentication uh, you will see the learn more the, those blue words two blue words learn more click it and you can get codes that you can secure right down set aside if you're not able to get into your instagram account through your email or your phone put it that way so you can use those codes that um instagram or facebook provides for you to get into your account if you are not able to get into your account by your phone or by your email so that's important um, another factor I want to mention is that you can verify your account by sending Instagram or Facebook. Um, you know, YouTube has to be verified, but you can send them your identification card information. Fill out that section there and you uh, will get your accounts verified. Um, it's very a very tricky process. Um, some people are not reading the information um to know what to do they think okay i have an instagram and it's automatically set up and i'm safe no you're not necessarily safe go in secure your accounts and make sure that you are taking care of yourself because this can be very draining you have worked so hard uh to build your accounts and people come and steal them from you it's not fun Right. Uh, let me see if there's anything else. Yes, there's one other thing that I need you to um, be aware of. When you click on security, look and you will see the login activity. Right. Know where you live, where you live, and and look where the log login activity is. If you are living in Massachusetts or New York. And your login activity is in Las Vegas there may be a problem that's when you want to change your password log out and log back in because somebody is scrutinizing your account all right so please be careful out there my fellow Instagrammers Facebookers and youtubers is um, this is very very vital to your well-being as well so take care bye bye